Hi everyone and welcome back to the zombies. In this video we'll be killing the Rainmaker. He's the latest of the warlords to be added into zombies so obviously we gotta take him down. But he's also quite bad at his job since there's no rain to be seen anywhere around so he has to go. The Rainmaker's fortress is located on the island in the southeast corner of the map, just off the Shaheen Manor. So that's where you need to check on the map to confirm whether it's him this time or some other warlord. Note that you need to zoom the map quite a bit for the fortress icon to appear. The ultimate weapon against the Rainmaker is the same as for every other warlord so far. The RGL, with any Pekka Punch level and a PhD flopper perk. I really wish there was some variety here, but alas, RGL is the king when it comes to mercs and warlords. As with every other fortress, you need to obtain a key card first, so to start with, get yourself a stronghold key using any means necessary. Buy it from any buy station for two grand if you like, rob a convoy, or hit one of the merc camps, whatever your preference is. Next, get into any mercenary stronghold. There's usually at least one really close to the manor, so check the map around the light to save yourself some traveling time. When hitting the stronghold, remember about the reinforcement healers coming in once you open the door and when you start the save drill. It's best to meet the healer outside and deal with it using your RGL instead of waiting for reinforcements to unload and having to kill them one by one. Once you open the safe, the fortress card will be inside for you to grab. Technically, you're ready to go, but I do advise to have a spare self-revive or a few with you. Mercs do hit quite hard and it's not unusual to go down while attacking the fortress. Since you have an RGL anyway, keep an eye for any chunks of flesh on the ground as you deal with zombies. Having a dog with you replaces the need for self-revives and has an added bonus since the dogs are very effective in killing mercs and distracting them from you. So if you have an option to get a dog, get one. Once you feel you're ready, proceed to Shaheen Manor. There are two zip lines leading onto the island, but I don't recommend using either of them. First of all, both have a claymore planted right where you land, and having an explosive go off under your feet at the start of the assault is normally not advised. On top of that, Rainmaker has several mortar crews stationed around the fortress, so you want to minimize the amount of time you spend outside in the open. So the best way to approach is to get on the roof of the manor and parachute off it straight to the door on the southern side of the building. There's usually one or two mercs guarding that door, so spam your RGL as soon as you mantle over the fence towards the door. As soon as the enemies outside are dealt with, get inside, so the mortars are no longer an issue. Go up the stairs directly in front of you and land a few grenades into the door frame on top of the stairs. Most of the door frames in the building are rigged with C4, so you want to clear those before you step in. Through the doorway you'll find yourself in the main hall with a bunch of mercs, the warlord himself, some turrets and some traps. As long as you don't rush it too much and keep spamming your RGL to clear any threat, you'll be fine. Some reinforcements can still come in, so make sure to cover your 6 too. The Warlord usually either stays on this floor and dies while you're clearing the area, or more often flees upstairs. Again, simply be methodical as you progress through the house, keep replating after being shot and keep landing those grenades and killing the Warlord will be a breeze. Most of the time, as soon as you kill the boss, the fortress is considered cleared and the reward rift spawns in the main hall. But sometimes, like with me here, it glitches out. In that case, just keep running around the house, killing the mercs as they come, and eventually you'll get the pop-up that the Rainmaker is down. Okay. 
The reward rift traditionally contains a guaranteed wonder weapon case, a unique blueprint gun and a random item. The blueprint gun for the Rainmaker is a FAMAS called Clean House with the underbarrel grenade launcher on it. Fancy but pretty useless, especially since it doesn't actually unlock for you and you can only use it as a contraband in zombies. And that's kind of it. Hope you found it useful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.